Appalachian Wireless is Appalachian Advantage. Unlimited text, talk, and two gigs of data for as low as $45 a month. Or if you like, get five lines on eight gigs of data for just $145 a month. See store for details. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless and East Kentucky Network Company. 51-year-old Verlia Fraley Coleman has run afoul of law enforcement again. She was indicted last year for trafficking in marijuana and was accused of selling to a juvenile. She received a probated sentence on a misdemeanor conviction in that case, while her husband Timothy Coleman was sentenced to five years in prison. Just last month, Coleman was allegedly found by police to be trafficking in marijuana and other drugs and was arrested. She's now been indicted on new drug trafficking charges. It was discovered that she was back to trafficking marijuana and was found with several different kinds of prescription drugs. So the grand jury has indicted her now for trafficking in the marijuana and the prescription drugs that were found in her home in September. Pike Commonwealth's attorney Rick Bartley said Kentucky probation and parole officers were conducting a home visit at Coleman's residence when they found her with drugs and other items related to drug trafficking. Court documents filed in Pike District Court said police had received complaints of possible drug trafficking activity at the residence. Probation officers went out there in September and discovered these drugs and they called in the Sheriff's Department and Detective Connolly with the Sheriff's Department did an excellent job, um, found not only marijuana, but found several different kinds of prescription drugs, including Suboxone and uh, some benzodiazepines, and also found scales and bags. So it's pretty obvious this was a trafficking operation, not a large-scale trafficking operation, but again, this was not somebody that just had a few pills of marijuana for personal use. We gave her a chance and she returned right back to trafficking again, and now she finds herself in jail and in prison where she needs to be. Verlia Fraley Coleman remains lodged in the Pike County Detention Center. Bartley said her probation has been revoked in her previous conviction, meaning she will have to serve a year at the Pike County Detention Center and could face an additional five years in this latest indictment. In Pike County, Chris Anderson, EKB News.